Hi, I'm having some trouble after I installed my third EZB with the variables on my rotations. On my uh, radar up here, that turns back and forth uh, through EZB control. Uh, the waist movement goes back and forth uh, through EZB control with the uh, first and second uh, EZB. Uh, board I have down there, you can see it down there, that one operates the waist rotation and the hip turning back and forth and a few other things. The one up in the torso, uh, you can see the blue light in there probably, you see it uh, steady on means it is connected and uh, that operates the uh, rotation back and forth and the ears and everything else going up and down, a lot of stuff on that one. The third EZB uh, is over here in the brain which is going to be sitting up on top up there and that's not going to do much other than control the lights uh, flashing patterns. I'll have different patterns. The, uh, the animation routine where I pull the power pack and everything goes dead and that motor um, that'll spin around and move those finger lights up and down and spin that crown around that'll be up on top here after this uh, top is uh, lowered. Um, but uh, anyway, that's that's the light control board right there, but that's the EZB. And I've got some other stuff laid in there um, that we're not going to talk about right now. But the problem is, once I uh, hooked the EZB, up, EZB board up to the computer over there through the Bluetooth, uh, you can see right now it's not connected because it's flashing on and off. Uh, it um, screws up my uh, variables, uh, my rotation. Uh, I'm going to give you a little routine right now, uh, show you a little demonstration of the way it's supposed to look. Uh, right now, I, again, I have just two easy bees hooked up. Robot, move radar. Oh, pay attention, my good friend. Hang on a second. Okay. Pay attention, my good friend. Robot, move radar. Oh. Robot, center. I gotta get some bugs worked out still. Robot, move radar. Okay, now you see I have uh, two positions programmed in, basically back and forth. Yeah, okay. He picks things up too and he's not supposed to. Um, but Robinson is not present and my sensors detect no danger. Okay, I'm going to shut up and just let you watch. <laughs> uh, it goes back to center and back and forth. Pause center. Nice and smooth. Back and forth. Robot, stop! Okay, back to center. So, see how nice that was? Everything stopped, everything's paused. Now, I'm going to go over here to the easy stuff here. Uh, connect the third easy B, which it is connecting right now. Okay, it's connected. Let's come over here and just uh, we can make sure. See, it's on. See? And just to demonstrate that it's on, I'm going to give you a little bit of a show here. The See the, the motor's running, the finger lights are going, they're dancing. I am in the Milky Way galaxy on the planet Earth. Be quiet, Ninny. <laughs> okay, and um, the light pattern will change a little bit there. See how fast it went? I can make it do that, and then I can make uh, let's make it look like he's died dead. So everything goes dead slowly. Comes back up. I push the button. See, that's the way it's supposed to look. Okay, now the problem is now we are hooked up here. Everything's working good. Uh, all these three easy bees are going in the radar. Pay attention, my good friend. Active. Okay, now watch what happens. Robot, move radar. 
it goes all the way it just goes kind of nuts past my stop points I have you can hear it no. ignore that ignore that it's just rocking back and forth trying to find centers not finding the uh, variable points I put in there to stop points it goes all the way around and hits the, the stop blocks I have in there with the limit switches. Thank God I got those in there. Yeah. So it's just rocking back and forth. It's not smooth. I know, that's annoying. <laughs> Robot, stop! So now it's supposed to stop find the center but it just keeps well that time it kind of found it see how far it's off center though it's supposed to be right off the, the hook there so it's there everything is kind of messed up I'm not sure what the problem is uh, I'm not be quiet Nenny okay fine okay now it'll shut up <laughs> um there you see it's kind of rocking back and forth when he's not supposed to be. Uh, it should have just stopped dead center and not did all that waggling back and forth. Um, same with the, uh, the hip rotation. Pay attention my good friend. You know, he doesn't know he's mad at me. So I'm going to just give you a... Uh, whoops. The, the hip Hips will go back and forth. Well, I'm having some problems there. Yeah, everything's all messed up because of that, so I can't get nothing started now. So everything works nice um, when the uh, easy B is uh, third easy B is off. I'm going to disconnect it. I just disconnected it. It's blinking over there. Um, pay attention my good friend. Pay attention my good friend. Okay. Now he'll, uh, robot start animation. And he'll move back and forth. Kind of nicely. Centered, stopped. Now I've got the third easy B disconnected and everything seems to be working nicely. And stopping at all the points I have scripted. Gears are moving. Okay. Robot, stop. Now everything should go back to center. And that's the way it's supposed to work. Um, you can see the big difference. Okay, hopefully uh, we can figure this out. Thanks for watching. Bye.